Greetings and salivations, everyone. I'm Krista. This is Fisher, and welcome to Sea Rad. Today we're reviewing the Kush Cameos Grogu, so stay tuned. Sea Rad. Hi, everybody. Well, hello, 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 everyone. Welcome. We hope everyone's doing totally rad today. A while ago, I did a merch news video about Koosh coming out with a Grogu and a Mandalorian Koosh ball. Well, I had pre-ordered them on Amazon, and the time is here. It's here, guys. How super adorable. So we're going to take him out of the box, give him a little review for you, and of course rate him on our scale of totally bad to totally rad. So Fisher, I need to set you to the side so I can do that. Are you good with that? I'm good with that. All right, little man. Boop. We will see you in a little bit. So, Koosh Balls. They are these little hard rubber balls in the center that have all these little kind of rubbery filament type things that you know make it bounce and jiggle and they're super cute these were really really big I think it was the early 90s that they became popular and I was glad to see that they still make them and really glad to see that they have a Grogu one but here he is in the box cute little face cute little hands not sure yet if he has feeties so yeah let's get him out of the box so we can take a look at his details how super cute guys he's a little wiggly jiggly grogu kind of like bacon if you don't know who bacon is check out that video right there but yep he's got the little rubber that makes the koosh ball a koosh ball and i can feel inside it's a tiny tiny hard ball it would be like taking rubber bands making a rubber band ball and then cutting the ends to get this kind of it looks hairy almost little fuzzy kind of look to it now, he's super cute face. I love it. Hands. No feeties, guys. I think they missed the mark on this one. Little dude, you ain't got no feeties. He's also a lot smaller than I thought he was going to be. I remember Koosh Balls being a little bit bigger, I think. But maybe that's because he's the cameos. Maybe they are a smaller version. I I'm not 100% sure. Haven't had a Koosh Ball in many, many years. But he's fun. You can play catch with him. <laughs> throw him. You don't want to kind of throw him and bounce him because you might kind of mess up the head and the hands a little bit. But super adorable and a really, really unique Grogu item that I'm glad they came out with. Now, I mentioned they also have a Mandalorian one, and this is what the Mandalorian one looks like. So you've got Mando, super cute, super cute hands there, and he is holding his blaster. I think it's about the same size as the Grogu one because they are the same price. Now, both Grogu and the Mandalorian are available on Amazon. They are shipping now. They are no longer a pre-order. Cost on the little Koosh Ball is $14.99, and of course I will put the links to both Grogu and the Mandalorian in the description of the video for you so you can grab one if you want one but he's super cute and a super fun little novelty item rating him on our scale of totally bad to totally rad he's kind of between a rad and a totally rad for me his face is super cute He's, you know, a koosh, so definitely unique and something that you don't see all the time. But I'm not going on a totally, totally rad on them because no feeties. They totally, totally missed it. They could have had little feeties hanging out the side here and he would have been just extra super adorable. But glad I got him. He would make a really unique Christmas gift for the Grogu lover on your Christmas list. It's not something you see every day, guys. So yeah, just between a rad and a totally rad for me. But what do you guys think? Do you agree? Let me know in the comments below. And thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more awesome and totally rad things in the future, please subscribe to our channel and turn that notification bell on so you don't miss seeing us. And I guess there's only one thing left to say, right, dude? We'll see you later.